Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a magic review. So we're gonna do another magic review today. And you knew that, you knew that because that's why you're here. You're here because you wanna see magic reviews. Good news, who's got two thumbs and likes doing magic reviews? This guy, that was dumb. But if you like magic reviews and if you like playing card reviews and if you like giveaways, then what I would do if I were you is I would subscribe, hit all your notifications so that you can be alerted when your favorite review goes live. Today, we're gonna look at a download. That's right, I am breaking my cardinal rule once again. Uh, I don't review downloads, if you don't already know. Uh, typically, typically. I've reviewed a lot more downloads lately than ever before, but on the norm, I don't review downloads because there's so many out there, and my to-do list gets really long, and so if you're gonna throw in downloads on top of that, it only gets longer, right? <laughs> so I typically don't review downloads. However, uh, today's is from uh, Josh Janowski, and I've done a couple of other reviews for Josh in the past, and so uh, Josh reached out to me and asked me to do this, and of course, I'm not gonna say no to Josh. So today we're gonna look at three different ACANs. We're gonna look at three different any card to any numbers. Josh offers all three of them as one downloadable 30 minute file and you can find it out there on the interweb. You can find it at his website, which is just joshandmagic.com. All right, when you start watching the video, it's gonna be Josh. Uh, he's gonna be talking to the camera. You're gonna get some close-ups, but not a ton. Uh, he is sitting amongst the pillows. He is well mic'd and you have some faint music in the background. And surprisingly, uh, he lives out in Canada with Ekaterina and Ekat is your cameraman, and so you'll hear her voice every now and then. On this download project, you're gonna learn three different any card to any numbers. The first one is J-Can. Uh, you might remember that Josh Janowski taught this on his At The Table lecture. The spectator calls out any card, then they deal down to the table where they wanna stop. Uh, I think this is a good, very fast, very simple any card to any number. However, it is kind of so simple, the spectator might catch what you did. Um, the second one is called Yes, We Can. Here again, the spectator calls out any card. It's lost in the center and shuffled, and then it's counted down to any number. This one's a great one for strolling because it all happens in your hands. The third one is Soda Can. Again, the spectator calls out a card and names any number from one to 52. At this point, Josh is gonna teach you two different versions. He's gonna teach you the setup version, and the setup version is really just sticking a marker card in the deck so that you know uh, where that card is. And he's also gonna teach you a no setup version, and this effect is followed by a live presentation. The nice thing about this effect is that you're getting the setup and the no setup version. Uh, the thing I didn't love so much is this one involves math. I'm really bad at math. Universally, all three tricks follow a very similar plot where the spectator calls out the card to you while you have the deck in your hands. And at that point, you do an additional thing. Either you locate the card, cut the cards, shuffle the cards. There, there's still some sort of movement that happens after the spectator calls out their card and before you place the deck down on the table. All right, so how much practice does this require? Um, I'm gonna say right off the bat that you should probably know your way around a deck of cards. A lot of these tricks involve you being able to control a card, either to the top or to the bottom. Uh, he's gonna give plenty of ideas, 
for shuffles. He's gonna give plenty of ideas for controls throughout, but you will need to know some slights. Uh, you'll need to know the coal. Uh, you'll need to know the ego force from Daniel Garcia and extraordinary proof from Andrew Gerard. How much setup and reset is there? Uh, like I said before, all three are totally impromptu. There is the one setup version, but you don't need to use the setup version. All three could be done with a borrowed deck. Two need a table and one can be done in the hands. Positives, all right, so what are the positives to this? Uh, first of all, the price, right? It's 10 bucks. $10 is very affordable. It's one of the most affordable uh, downloads you can get, especially for 30 minutes worth of instruction and three tricks, right? Very affordable and it's Josh Janowski, recognized name. We know he puts out good stuff. Uh, there's no memory work on these, okay? There's no memory work. It's all happening in the moment as the spectator's calling out their card or as they're calling out their number. Like I said, you can do this with a borrowed deck. They're very fun tricks, they're very creative tricks and they will be very easy tricks for the skilled card worker. Negatives, all right, so what are the negatives to this? Are they the very best any card to any numbers in the entire world? No, they're not the best in the world, but they are what they claim to be, and I think that's what you need to pay attention to. They're completely impromptu. They require no memorization. You can do this with a borrowed deck, and it allows you to just jump into doing an any card to any number. And the cool thing is, you know, like I mentioned earlier, they kind of follow a similar theme. So if you did one for Steve and Steve said, do it again, you could do it again for Steve and switch it up to a different one of the methods or just do it for somebody else in the room. Just turn to Bill and say, okay, we'll do it with you. And it'll look like you're almost doing the same effect, but it's actually now using a different method and it'll totally erase the first method. So I think combining these together, if you're going to do this for a, a, a crowd or for some people in your, in your, at your party, I think together they would destroy because each one then erases the previous version and people will never be able to follow or backtrack how you're doing this. As far as who would like this, I think anybody that likes the any card, any number plot, right? You collect those and you want a couple of extras that you can have just in your memory ready to go that you could do at a moment's notice when anyone says, hey, you know, do that trick where you find any card, any number, you borrow a deck and you could go right on into it. And before I go, I want to remind you that we now have the community tab up there uh, that is a new place at Magic Orthodoxy where you can now watch extra videos. You can watch even more reviews and you can watch my rants, my raves. You can watch unboxings behind the scenes. There's all kinds of new content up there and new content being added every week. It's only $1.99 a month. Just click the join button below and I appreciate your support. Well, that's everything I can say about You Can Do It from Josh Janowski. If you'd like to pick it up for yourself, the only place you can find it is at justjoshandmagic.com. I want to thank Josh for sending me this so that I could do the review for you and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Got another magic review for you today, but you knew that. That's why you're here. You're here because you like magic. What is this? This is my... Ugh. Hey everybody, welcome back to the ma magic show. <laughs>